Meanwhile, humanitarian groups have urged European states to do more to prevent migrant deaths. UNHCR and Norwegian Council of Refugees voiced concern after 65 people drowned while crossing the Mediterranean Sea. More details in this report. As the fighting in Tripoli continues, more Libyans are attempting to make the dangerous journey into Europe. According to the International Organization for Migration, 2,297 migrants died or went missing in the Mediterranean last year. Jen England, head of the Norwegian Council for Refugees, says European states have a responsibility to stop these tragedies. What is the European? It's all of us Europeans' uh, responsibility to avoid this mass hemorrhage of human lives in the Mediterranean. The Italian government has led an effort to disrupt human smuggling networks to tackle the problem. But UNHCR spokesman Barbara Baloch says this will not be enough. So it's really a desperate situation. We have been calling on states for uh, building up search and rescue uh, capacity in the Mediterranean. We have been showing our concerns about not having any boats to rescue these peoples. UNHCR spokesman Barbara Baloch asserted that states have a duty to protect those traveling in their territorial waters. Norwegian Council for Refugees head Jan England points out other countries have worsened the war in Libya. There has to be a place that needs stability, needs conflict resolution, doesn't need all of these countries now fueling the fire and giving generals hope that they can take over. For now, the war in Libya rages on. As such, migrants will continue to brave the pearls of the Mediterranean.